Hello everyone, how's it going? Welcome back to another brand new episode of Bass Master Fishing 2022. And today I want to go for um trouts. Trouts and salmon. That's I just I want to do it. So we're gonna go ahead. Oh, you know what? Can we even go for them? Because we need the lures. Uh that's the issue. So let's have a look here. St. Lawrence River, I believe, is the river that we need to go to rainbow trout pulsar spin bait bluegill easy easy uh ben parker magnum spoon oh yeah ben parker magnum spoon so let's go ahead ben parker whoops not this stupid the way you go in to buy What in this? I don't know what the heck that was. Spoons? Okay, well, Ben Parker. I got to see. Ben Parker. What? Oh, you know what? It's because uh, I think we have this. I uh, know, wait. Perfect. Now we can uh, go after everything. Aha, uh -huh, here we go. So Ben Parker Magnum Spoon, that's what we need. Yes, we, ha we had the money. Heck yeah. Let's go ahead and select this. Perfect, 50 pound weight. And uh, whatevs, whatevs. How much money do we have? We have three grand. Wow, okay, everything starts from 4,500. I think our reel is the most expensive one. Yes, it is. Our line is most expensive, so we just need a better rod. Uh, but I don't think these rods have any stats. So let's go ahead and get started. Laurent Laurent. Uh, perfect. Perfect. St. Lawrence River in between Canada and U.S. But we will, uh, for now, assume we are on the Canadian side because I'm a Canadian. That's where I want to be. Uh... Get started. Where should we go? Hmm. Usually close to the dock, the starting point is where all the fish are. Want to make sure we have the gizzard. Oh, did I buy the wrong one? Uh oh. I think I bought the wrong one. But it's okay. It should work either way. Uh, two, two one retrieval speed. Okay, it does not drop down. If there are salmons and stuff, they're gonna have to be chilling, uh, not in the deep end. How about we increase the speed, does it? No, it doesn't uh, decrease in depth. I'm sorry, increase in depth the faster we go. Okay, so I'm assuming we got to be in like a shallower area. I feel like the salmons are going to be at the bottom, which they're not supposed to be. But in this game. Uh, oh. Someone just honked. Hey, a cute little perch, a yellow, stop honking, who the heck is honking over there? Let's throw it that way, let's throw it towards the, sh towards the shallow end. Guys, please don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment below. Really appreciate it. Let's see, let's see. Let it sink. Oh, that's all it sinks up to. Hmm, 
do we see any fish? Very murky water. Uh, 1.8 meter. Yeah, like someone keeps honking. What the heck? In game, obviously. Uh, that was like a purge or a crappy type of a fish. So that's not what we're interested in. The salmons. Where the heck are the salmons going to be? They really don't. <sighs> yeah, you would expect, you know. Salmons to be in specific places, but in this game it just doesn't matter. They're everywhere. They spawn randomly. All fish do. Uh, so whatever your real life, real life knowledge is, just throw it out the window because it doesn't matter. We're gonna go ahead and go towards uh, that island over there. Okay, we are arriving at the island. Uh, Q. Let's see. Let's see if there's anything here. Yeah, I see a tiny little... Oh, oh, that fish is going vertical. Oh, it's going vertically down now. Oh, I think that's a salmon. What the heck is that fish doing? It's going up and down. <laughs> oh, man, this game... Uh Okay, so that I think was a salmon. Oh, what the hell? Oh, it snagged. Okay, what the, what the heck was that? All of a sudden my view changed and I'm like, what the heck happened? And it's like, oh, you're snagged. Ooh, there's a fish back there. It's a little crappy. I think. Man, that brown trout or salmon, whatever it was, it was that was going vertically up and down. Oh, we need that. Come on, baby. That thing's gonna come out of the blue and go for it. Okay. Try again. Let's try again. Okay, let's go ahead and try. Ooh. Oh, 99 percentas. 99%. There we go. The perfect cast. Now, are we gonna get a fish? Ooh wee! A big bass. But I don't want a bass. Ooh. Okay. That's a bigger. Biggin. I mean, it looked big. Oh, what the heck? It's tiny. How does that even happen? Oh, seriously? Try again. There we go. Yeah, it's a tiny little bassy bass. Uh, one at KG. Okay. Let's throw a little bit more to the right. Let it sink. What is that fish in the background? That could be a salmon. Oh, it's... What? Fish on? Huh? Guys, did you see a fish? Because I sure as heck did not see a fish. I thought I was snagged again. Ow. How does that even happen? You know what? I'm not complaining. We got a fish. That's all that matters. Where's this guy? 42 meters away. 40 meters away. Fifty pound line, come on dude. Okay, the fish is swimming towards us. It's windy, I can hear the wind. Twenty-eight meters away, the fish is now coming. Now it's oh, it's surfacing. One point three meters, one meter, point eight. We're gonna see this guy soon. Oh, that's a pike. Not what I expected. It is a free fish nonetheless. So come 
Come on, come into the circle already. Already, I can get ya. Just playing around with us. Friction break doesn't even matter. Why even? Okay, there we go. We got him. Okay, Tiger Muscle Lunge. 7.24 kg. Is that a trophy? I have no idea. It could be my personal best. So, yeah. Okay, I just casted. Thinking maybe an invisible fish will strike again. I really... I, I need to look back at the footage. I swear I did not see a fish. <laughs> that was just funny. Uh, man, but where are the salmons? I feel like this is going to be a challenge to get them. Ooh, there it is. Oh, please, please. <laughs> I so badly want one. Why, Salmon? Why do you keep going vertically up towards the sky and vertically down towards the ground? <laughs> please, be horizontal for once. <laughs> so close. It's sinking, it's sinking. I hope the salmon is still there. <gasps> oh no, that's a bassy bass. No. Ah. Salmon are supposed to go for this lure. Oh, that's a perch. I'll take a perch. It's something different. I know we've already caught a perch, but this looks slightly bigger. <gasps> Whoa, that's a walleye. It's a baby walleye. <gasps> oh my god, it's so cool. Uh, more? Walleye is the biggest member of the perch family and is native to Canada and North America. The ma majority of their body is gold and green in color, which is broken up by the darker saddles down their sides. The teeth and dorsal fin of a walleye are both very sharp. Coolio! You know what? That is a bonus catch. I'm happy with that. It's sinking. One fish just came for it. But it decided not to, so I'm happy because it's a small fish. Don't need that. Salmon, where are you at? At Salmon. No. Stay back, Walla. I've already caught one. Another small fish. That's a bass. Maybe. Ooh, big bass. Big bass. I think. Quick catch there. Beautiful largemouth bass. I will take that. Okay, you know what? This is a good spot. There's a lot of fish. There's a lot of fish. Oh, man. You know what? That's a nice sized pike. <laughs> but these fish are not letting me have a chance with the salmon. This lure is potent. Damn. Everyone wants this lure. Come on, Caliber. You can do it. The black reel, so it kind of looks like a caliber. Uh, are we gonna get this guy quick? The small little pike, by the looks of it. Underwater, they look so big. Come on. Let's go. There we go. Oh, wow, look at the patterns on that ti tiger muscalunge. Beautiful. Nice. I like it. Damn it. 
as soon as I throw through it, um, the tiny little crappy or whatever it is decided to. Oh, you know what? It's it's so beautiful. It's oh, they're really beautiful in this. Oh no, I skipped over. No. Okay, again, guys, this was an invisible fish. Like, legit, it was an invisible fish. And my heart's beating, which means it's a big fish, or maybe it's a trophy? And the view has gone all blurry. I just, I hate that. Why? It's, it's not an intended design. I'm very sure. But I guess it is a trophy, whatever I got. I hope it's a salmon. That would be so good. So good. Obviously, I'm... <laughs> I can't see. When a big, big fish strikes, our, our human here, our person here, our Lewis Hamilton of the fishing world just goes blurry-eyed. It's just too stressful for him. Oh no, please don't get stuck there. He just hit the shore. That fish really wants to end its life. Or it lets us have it. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna have my finger on the on the E key in case it comes close to the boat. But I feel like Oh, it doesn't give me the option. What a little punk. We have to fight the fish forever. And we don't... Oh, wow. Okay, so unfortunately, not a salmon. Uh, but it is a big, big pike, perhaps. I'm hoping it's a trophy, the way your heart beats and the vision goes blurry. But I don't know. We'll find out soon enough. Are you done? Just messing around with us now. Can't even see my rod. Like, what am I doing with my rod? Come on, let's go. Let's go, Pikasaurus. Oh, oh, wow. Wow, that's a monster, guys. That is a monster. 13.77 kg northern pike. Expand more. Sometimes it's described as a freshwater shark, the northern pike. Found throughout most of the northern hemisphere in both lakes and rivers. The carnivorous fish, the pike will take most fish baits. It has been seen to eat frogs, mice, and even snatch water birds from the surface. Perfectly camouflaged. Green flanks are speckled by yellow spots. I don't see no yellow spots on this one. And stripes which will break up its outline effectively as it waits amongst the reed. Reeds to ambush its prey. A long fish with most of the fins that well back. A uh, pike has over 700 teeth and its hard bony mouth. So you'll need sharp hooks and strong tackle to get this one to the bank. Wow. Feared by many anglers due to its razor sharp teeth. Woe betide you if your fingers slip inside that dark gaping maw. Very nice. Surprise catch of the day. Wow. It's dropping. Oh, come on. Again. Nagged again. Okay. There we go. We should be clear from the snags. Oh, there is a salmon back there. A coho. Oh, nice. There's a few of them. He's clearly not interested. He just... He wants to go to the... Come on. There's so many salmons here. How come no one is interested? This is the perfect lure for them. Can't be serious. Ah! 
I recast, they're gonna respawn. Hopefully not, but... I need this. I need this badly. Come on. Okay, another cast. Another dollar. Let's start retrieving it before we get like a ghost snag. Oh, wow. Look at that. That's a beautiful whatever that is. It has spots. It doesn't have those uh, horizontal lines. It's a different type of pike. Muscalunch, Muscaluge, whichever one. Um... I don't know if these salmons are broken or what. But I really hope we can get one. No. No, please. Please, man. Oh, it's a tiny little baby. Oh, it's not coming in that hole. Come on. Come on, let's go so I can end this quick. Let me end this quick. <clears throat> Okay, he's done for anyway. Tiny little tiger muscle lunch. No. I just threw it and boom, we got this guy quick time. Black crappy, cool. Is this gonna be the one? Is this retrieval gonna get us the salmon or the trout? I think the brown trout? Are we gonna get that? Let's have a look. Wow. Wow, we need that. That's a brown trout, is it not? Come on, they're not interested. Why? Bothering me. So many right here. Is it our braided line? I really don't think fish care in this game. Ah, no. Not what I want. Yes. Okay, largemouth bass. Maybe this is the one? Question mark, question mark. Oh, look at that. Beautiful salmon down there. A trout. I, I don't know, okay? Two of them there. On, I need something. Salmon or trout, either or. Not a pike. Not a musclelunge. Nothing else. No. Bad fishy. Bad. Bad fishy. It's stuck. Stuck. We're just gonna give it a little bit of time, so it's. You know, it gets tired. There we go. That was quick. Uh, Northern Pike. Finally, we catch a pike. 2.81 kg. Very nice. Okay, another Xander here. This seems to be slightly bigger than our first one. Quickly bring this guy in. Oh, come on. He went through that hole. We can easily catch him, but it's okay. He's done anyway. Oh, yeah. This is bigger. 4.1 kg walleye. I wish we could zoom in on the fish in this view. And it sucks we can't. But, yeah. That's good. Could this be the one? Yes! Yes! There we go. There we go. Finally. Oh, my God. I waited forever for this. I don't know if this is a small one. Yes. Oh my god. Yes. Brown trout 1.14 kg. I waited forever for this. A brassy fish with a coat of many colors. Brown trout have been widely introduced across the world as a result of their value and both food and sport fishing. The dark flanks of the brown trout often feature bright red spots. Surrounded by a pallor halo or a creamy yellow belly and it is one of just a few species to boast an easily identifiable adipose fin between dorsal sail and caudal fin. Brown trout can be found in many deep locks 
reservoirs, rivers, and chalk streams, and can be seen rising to the surface on a summer evening. Pick may fly in midge. So individual fish may be targeted on spinners and lures or can be tempted. The fat juicy worm trotted down the stream beneath a float. A cannibal, the fish will often eat its own species. Oh no! Or any other fish it can ambush in addition, taking insects, larvae, and crawfish. Larger trout will even prey on mice and wolves. Very cool indeed. Only a 1 kg, but man, finally. Alright guys, this is going to be it for this episode. Let's go ahead and quit and see what fish we got. Wow, we made 5,740 fish coins and 271 new followers. Um, Northern Pike was our biggest catch, 14 kg, 1 meter out. Look at these fish. This spot is just amazing. Uh, it's OP. Uh, yellow pike, sea tiger musculunch. I feel like this is like our largest catch. I don't know. See, this is not yellow or gold. Oh no, this isn't gold either. Northern pike, 13 kg. Walleye, look at all these fish I've caught. Brown trout. Brown trout. And, uh... Yeah, we are level 10 almost. Not sure what the heck that does. I don't know what levels do, um, <clears throat> but that was amazing. A player profile uh, catches. No. Species list brown trout. There you go. Brown trout is what we've caught, 1.14 kg. Unfortunately, it was too small, so it didn't have good coloration. Uh, but yeah, we finally have one. Yes, yeah, so our best, our largest catch for crappies. Yeah, I don't understand. There's this, 10 catches, and then there's 10 brown catches as well. Doesn't make any sense. And for the bluegill, I have three regular catches and then four brown catches i guess three are non-markers and four are marker fish above a certain size that's what they are i don't know really want a coho man i want these fish so bad maybe another episode maybe next episode we can try for them uh but yeah that is so cool thank you so much for watching like subscribe comment below i will see you in the next one until the next time guys enjoy